feel like this video needs to be more serious, so let's try to go for that tone. Welcome back to the channel. This is KJB, and I'm here to report the news. Today, we're talking about Kai Sinat. Now, Kai Sinat, probably one of the biggest streamers in today's age, you know? Kai Sinat has been running the game on Twitch for at least three to four years. He's been killing it with AMP, and he's been killing it, you know, getting sponsorships, getting commercials, doing his thing. But that all changed. It didn't change for the good, but it changed for. Well, it was it, it, you could say for the good, because at the end of the day, he kind of won. There's some backstory. Now, I was going through the internet a couple days ago, and I was like, hmm, I want to go on Twitter. Went on Twitter, and he was trending. I was like, hmm, why is Kai Sinat trending? I'm thinking it's another AMP video, but I was wrong. I was wrong. Apparently, this woman named Layla Red, OF woman, OF model, corn model, corn star, whatever you name it, she is one of Thought of Miss Prime's oh girls. My God. Decided she wanted to sit here and try to ruin this man's life. Now, she went on Instagram and she posted a bunch, when I say a bunch, a damning evidence that Kai sat there and just, she just sent her $5,000 and she kept saying something about hush money. It wasn't looking good for Kai. Kai had to sit here, he had to find a way, he had to find a way to get out of this jam she kept going on Instagram Twitter whatever you name it she was on there but Kai responded now I, I know what you're thinking how did Kai respond well Kai was a smart man Kai sat there he made her sign an NDA what is an NDA, you might ask? A non-disclosure agreement. This woman sat here and provided evidence that nobody else needed to know of that happened between them. Now, when you do that, he could bring this to court and he could sit there and say that she signed the NDA. She can't do that. It's looking, you know, it's looking good in his favor in court. She also, not only did she signed the NDA and gave information, she also sat there and did revenge corn. And if you don't know what revenge corn is, is show, sharing explicit pictures when when the other person doesn't give consent. Mm, 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 mm. Now, that's terrible. Now, this isn't the first time we've seen this, you know, this problem of many athletes, many celebrities, rappers have been caught doing this kind of act where the OF model or corn star, as you may call it, will try to extort the person for money. And it never ends well, like at all. It doesn't matter if you try and expose that person. It doesn't really work out in their favor at all. So she just kept messing up. And Kai went on his stream to let her know what she did, how she got done, and how he won. Put it up, put it up. It happens all this. Shit, they don't understand. Everything will come to light. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. 
No weapon formed against me shall prosper. We done been here again. This will be the last time I'm doing it. But you, ma'am. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not addressing you as Layla Red. I'm now addressing you as Kiara Rush. Because that's who I'm talking to, Kiara. We're not calling you by your old ass name. We talk, we, we're talking to Kiara. It's your time. To buy your domain, Layla. I bought your domain because you didn't buy it when you first started your career, didn't you? So, Layla. I have bought your domain. Now you might ask, what does that mean, Kai? It means every time somebody types in Kiara Rush, anytime somebody types in Layla Red, the first website that they will click on is all the lies you've told me, all the crimes you've done, all the dumb shit you just put yourself in to fuck up your life. The top link will be Kiara Rush, okay? Showing everything that you've done, okay? And you made a mistake fucking with me. So, it's not looking good for Layla Red right now. It's not looking good at all. She sat there. Not only did she sit here and try to get him a revenge corn, but she tried to put some damning evidence as well as calling him P. Diddy Jr. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Now, I made a video about Diddy, and that's a pretty strong allegation of calling him P. Diddy Jr., of saying that he tried to sell her to one of his homeboys. Now, it's, it's just not a good look, you know? It's just it's sad. And I hope Kai can, you know, learn his lesson that these hoes ain't loyal. Chris Brown but yeah that was you know news with KJV um I want y'all to take this message and run with it as you will um don't fall in love with these hoes out here because once they try to expose you you better be ready that was KJB, and I'm signing off.